Today is day four of the planting for food and jobs market initiative started by the Ministry of Food and Agriculture since last week, Friday. Today, Wednesday, they have decided to bring it onto the markets proper. And this is the to-do market. Right behind me, you can see uh, some market women or some individuals massing up to uh, get some plantains to buy. We'll just speak to them and find out what they make of the prices. 25 cities. 25 cities. Greek minister, what boy do man? I mean, show pa. Omo omo ba ya omo anya bi na chuno omo omo anya bi. So excited because our minister is doing well. Yes. In fact, see about market ni mo. Market women are killing us. But ene nyami adom ya minister. She ni amiki te yo. Fifteen cities, fifteen cities. Oh, mato, mato. Okay, okay. okay, but when you say that the, the market women are cheating you, I mean it is not by their will, that's why they are increasing the price. so, they be had amato so, now me be say dollar no, I can't phone an dollar no, I can't buy the Traders in the market were excited about the move by the ministry, but were disappointed that there wasn't enough food stuff for all to buy. Okay. <laughs> The sales executives were also under heated pressure as they complained about the mad rush for the food items which turned chaotic. I said, some line am I because you can't someone sell lines now. I'm on penny. Where's something I may buy? A do baby can not be the table. A mule be him or be your coin. You mule be nine. Yes, rabbi. And then here I am. Yes, security without security. I am not your bread. The Agri Ministry is certain of expanding the markets in subsequent days. Initially, we had challenges with controlling the crowd because. You know, unlike what is happening at the ministry, this is a very enclosed area. And so we had difficulty controlling the crowd. So people were massing up and there was stampede. So the police had to come in to uh, 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 ensure order and uh, sanity. From then we were able to sell to everybody. We, we may have underestimated the, the, the attitude or the behavior of the crowd because we have been in the in the ministry and we dealt with people with in discipline form but here we realize that a lot of people are eager to buy and so we had difficulty controlling them simply because this is what they do here that's the activity when trucks come to offload uh, plantain there's always the kind of just a bustling for the for the goose and that's exactly what we we encountered this morning. Lastly, before you go, uh, a lot of people have been asking this question since the initiative started, that how sustainable can this be and how long are you going to be doing yeah, this? Because when we started last Friday, people were just waiting to say that, oh, at the end of the when we said it, they couldn't do, but we did Monday, we did Tuesday, we are doing today, tomorrow we are going to do. So as long as the foods are available and we are able to convey them to the big cities, we'll continue to do. And from the traders here at uh, Tudu, specifically the fire service station, well, what they are asking for is for variety of foodstuff to be available uh, on the market so that they can be able to purchase. Well, as you heard from the Ministry of Food and Agriculture, they would be bringing more items to the market at cheaper prices and ensuring that anybody who walks in here would be able to get his or her share. Reporting for City News, my name is Akosia Otri.